Hello everyone, welcome back to Infigyan. In this video, we are going to take up another very very interesting question from system of equations. So let's get started by considering this is our equation 1 and this we will call equation number 2. Now I will consider a squaring of equation 1 both sides. So I can write x plus y whole square will be 2 square. So I can use a plus b whole square formula which is x square plus y square plus 2 times xy equal to 4. Or I can write x square plus y square this will be equal to 4 minus 2xy. Let's say this is our equation number 3. Now we can consider cubing of the same equation both sides. So I will write x plus y whole cube. This will be equal to 2 cube. Let's apply a plus b whole cube formula. So we will get x cube plus y cube plus 3 times xy times x plus y equal to 2 cube is 8. Now x plus y as per equation 1 it is 2. So I can write x cube plus y cube plus 3 times 2 is 6 xy equal to 8 or the value of x cube plus y cube. This will come out 8 minus 6xy. Let's say this is equation number 4. Now we will multiply equation 3 and equation 4. So we will multiply LHS with LHS and RHS with RHS. Let's multiply x square plus y square times x cube plus y cube equal to 4 minus 2xy times 8 minus 6xy. Let's multiply x square times x cube x power 5 y square times y cube y power 5 then we have x square y cube then we have y square x cube in right hand side we will write 4 minus 2 x y and if I will take 2 common from this bracket, we will get 4 minus 3xy. Now x power 5 plus y power 5. As per equation number 2, we can write 82. Plus, from these two terms, we can take x square y square common. So in the bracket, we will get y plus x. In RHS we can write 2 times 4 minus 2xy times 4 minus 3xy. Now x plus y is 2. So I can write 82 plus 2 times x square y square equal to 2 times 4 minus 2xy times 4 minus 3xy. Now we can see equation is divisible by 2. Let's divide both sides by 2. So I will get 41 plus x square y square. This will be equal to 4 minus 2xy times 4 minus 3xy. Now I will consider xy equal to a. As you can see 
here we can write x y whole square and where we have x y so i can write let's say x y equal to a so equation will become 41 plus a square equal to 4 minus 2a times 4 minus 3a. Let's expand RHS. 41 plus a square will be equal to 16 minus 12a minus 8a plus 6a square. Or we can write 41 plus a square will be equal to 16 minus 20a plus 6a square. Now take all the terms to RHS. 6a square minus a square. 5a square minus 20a. 16 minus 41 minus 25 equal to 0. Let's take 5 common. So in the bracket we will get a square minus 4a minus 5 equal to 0. Or we can write a square minus 4a minus 5 equal to 0. Now this is one quadratic equation. I can use method of factorization. So I will split minus 4a as minus 5a plus a. Then we have minus 5 equal to 0. From first two terms we can take a common out. So in the bracket we will get a minus 5. From last two terms we can take 1 common out. So a minus 5 will be in the bracket equal to 0. Or we can write a minus 5 times a plus 1 equal to 0. From product 0 rule, we can write either a minus 5 equal to 0 or a plus 1 equal to 0. So from our first equation, a will become 5. And from second equation, a will be negative 1. Now a was our substitution x y. So I can write x y equal to 5 and x y equal to negative 1. Now I will use our first equation x plus y equal to 2. So I can write y will be equal to 2 minus x. So I can write y as 2 minus x here equal to 5 and here I will write x times 2 minus x equal to negative 1. So we have to solve these two equations. Let me write here x times 2 minus x equal to 5. Then we will consider x times 2 minus x equal to negative 1. Let's expand 2x minus x square equal to 5. Multiply this equation by minus 1 by negative 1. So we will get minus 2x plus x square equal to negative 5 or I can write x square minus 2x equal to negative 5. Now I will consider one manipulation step. Let's add 1 to both sides. Now LHS will give us one perfect square. We can write this is x minus 1 whole square and RHS will be negative 4. Now square is negative, 
so solutions will be complex so i can use the property from complex number i square is negative 1 so here i can write this is 4 i square which will be equal to 2i whole square. Now I will write x minus 1 whole square equal to 2i whole square. Now we will consider a square root both sides. So a square root and a square will be over from both the sides. And we have to consider plus and minus sign in our RHS. So I will write plus minus 2i. Add 1 to both sides. We will get x equal to 1 plus minus 2i. Two complex values of x. Now I will use equation 1. From there I can write y equal to 2 minus x. So I can calculate here y also. y will be equal to 2 minus x or I will write 2 minus x is 1 plus minus 2i. I can write RHS 2 minus 1 minus of plus minus. So I can write minus plus 2i. 2 minus 1 is plus 1, minus plus 2i. So with x 1 plus 2i, we are getting y 1 minus 2i. And with x 1 minus 2i, we are getting y 1 plus 2i. So I can write ordered pair x comma y equal to 1 plus 2i then we are getting y as 1 minus 2i and if we are taking x as 1 minus 2i then we are getting y as 1 plus 2i. Now we have to consider our second quadratic equation. It was x times 2 minus x equal to negative 1. Expand LHS 2x minus x square equal to negative 1. Now we will multiply both sides by negative 1. So let us write here times negative 1. We will get minus 2x plus x square equal to 1 or I can write x square minus 2x equal to 1. Now I will add 1 to both sides. Now you can see LHS will give us one perfect square of x minus 1 and RHS will be 2. Now we will consider a square root both sides. A square root, a square root. So I can write x minus 1 will be equal to plus minus a square root 2. x minus 1 equal to plus minus a square root 2. Now we will add 1 to both sides. We will get x equal to 1 plus minus square root 2. Now using equation number 1, I can write y will be equal to 2 minus x. Let's calculate y also. y will be 2 minus x. 2 minus x is 1 plus minus square root 2. Let's expand the bracket 2 minus times 1. So I will write minus 1 minus times plus minus. So it will reverse the sign minus plus root 2. 2 minus 1 is 1. 
माइनस प्लस स्क्वायर रूट टू अगेन आई कैन राइट टू ऑर्डर्ड पेयर्स लेट अस राइट एक्स वाई विद एक्स वन प्लस स्क्वायर रूट टू वाई इज वन माइनस स्क्वायर रूट टू एंड विद x 1 minus square root 2 y is coming out 1 plus square root 2 so we have two real and two complex ordered pairs i hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching bye bye till next video take care goodbye